Well, I think I shall. I think I shall start my day in my favorite place. I have a lot of people on the trail. My hotel is right back there, right when you emerge off of the boardwalk here. I'll be around here. Here's the boardwalk. And then over to Black Rock down there. It may or may not be already. Here's the airport beach. I was thinking it was the other direction from us it's down here. Um, despite the fact that I woke up at 3.30 a.m., 6.30, 7.30, 8.30, and it's now after 9.30, I'm actually on my walk. I was so blitzed today, and I don't know why, oh, I do know why I kept waking up, because that's normal times back at home, so. I was kind of worried that it would be too sunny out here, but it's actually overcast, and I'm going to need my sunglasses on. There's a little breeze, it's warm, it's going to feel good. <sighs> kind of know this is going to be my morning respite. Love being here with my sister and I. Even when I'm coming with Jason, it's always nice to just kind of step out and go alone. But uh, oh, I just really feel like this is like my stomping grounds. Like this is like, oh, it's like home to me. It just feels so good. I think part of it is that I started like my health journey by doing this, like by being here on a walk. There's the Hanua Kai. I don't know really how to explain. Oh, I'm walking in the pouring, pouring rain, Hawaiian rain. <laughs> or shall we say non kawaii rain? This is totally manageable rain. Um, I'm in heaven. Hanua Kai is like home to me. I've already seen like three kitty cats and oh, anyway uh, the boardwalk ends right here I think we're gonna go all the way to the end it's three quarters of a mile back to my hotel but I think Aaron is back in the room making us bacon and uh, when I get there we'll make eggs she can have her eggs if she wants to we're not gonna rock it over the street. So anyway, I'm just gonna enjoy this. Everyone's kind of packing it back up from the beach. And boom, I'm going back to that room. I'm like, ah, the rain will stop. A little wet can't get you. So, all right, finished my walk. Aaron made bacon for us. Burnt bacon. Oh, stop! <laughs> and one piece of burnt bacon. Um and I got a little bit cleaned up, but I, know, also, but I know it's kind of muggy out here, and so there's not much point to like fully getting cleaned up. But we are not gonna do beach right away. It's kind of windy, You're waiting for the cloud cover to kind of go away. We're just going to go for a little scenic drive, go, out, go all the way up the coast to the Nakaidele blowhole, and then we know now to turn around and come back, not to go further and <laughs> go around the island. So come along with our little scenic drive. We'll likely end up lunch somewhere, probably a shave ice. We haven't done that yet. Just kind of getting lay of the land. And as soon as the sun kind of peaks its head and the wind stops blowing, we'll probably hit a beach or the pool or something. Yes. Okay. Yes. <laughs>
fact that I'm wearing flip flops going down to see the Nakulele blowhole. But we'll see how long I feel like going down. He's getting closer for a better shot. But I'm feeling athletic today, I should say. So we're gonna try it. We're having a fun time just driving the road here. Just pay attention to the parking. It. Aaron's hanging out up there. I'm going to the car. I'm going to the water. I'm going to get out of the heat. The sun came out right before we started doing this. Alright, we made our way to Waylers Village. We are very hungry. Correct? And um, hoping we can get in to what's it called? Hula Grill for lunch. Open it. Side by side we sway there in all the colors Some love Lonesome love Folded on the lawn chair in all the colors Some down to the beach. We've been relaxing in our room for about an hour after shopping and eating lunch. This is a pretty good way to end our night, don't you think? Open air Side by side we sway there in all the colors Some
Like that.